Hey, what is up guys? Welcome to this tutorial. And now you'll learn how to add an image compare module to your website with Jet Elements plugin. All you need to do is to search for the image comparison widget over there in the elements panel. You grab it and drop it onto a new section. As you see, you can add multiple slides in there. And here are the items you can add. So let's say we want to show one item at a time. So we now will set the slides to show option to one. Pause on hover. I'll toggle this to yes and the slider will pause once I hover over the image. The autoplay is toggled to yes. The autoplay speed is here in milliseconds. Infinite loop determines whether the slides will change infinitely. The effect, so you choose one of those. The animation speed, whether you want to enable the arrows navigation, so it's a little bit more intuitive that the user can go ahead and scroll between the items in there. And whether you want to show the dots navigation, so your show keys of before and after images can easily turn into a slider. So now let's actually go ahead and add the images and see how the image comparison thing works. So you change the labels in here. So now they say before and after, but you can change it to whatever you need. Like for instance, so it can also be that before image. Let it be that. So now you are seeing it. As you see, now the images are matching and the size. So you can easily grab that slide. And as you move the slide, you see that now you can see more of this after image. And now more of this before image. So for this example, I will go with no slider, but a simple image comparison. So here in the settings tab, let's remove the dots. And now what you see is the settings for the container, for the label. So you can really change its look just the way you want it to be. Like that and here is set the alignment so if you wish you can totally position it here at the top or here in the middle of the image this is just up to you so both labels can be changed separately and if you wish them to look different just go ahead and make them look different And next, there go the settings for the handle. Here's the width of this control handle and the height of it. And the background will be of that color and the arrow color. I want to leave as it is. The handle divider is that white thing. And you change the width of this divider. You change the color of the divider. So if you wish, go ahead and change it to the one that you prefer. And divider starting position, now it is set to the center, right in between, but you can totally change its position. So here you go. And here you change the look of the handle arrow, so it can be of different types. And you change the icon size. Here go the arrows that allow you to control the slider and the dots. So these settings have to be familiar to you if you have ever created a slider with Jet Elements. So now we're done creating an image comparison module inside Jet Elements. 
I hope you enjoyed this tutorial and found it useful and thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video.